Coogan Cassius Eiffel TV with MGM Marbella here in Manchester for the Tyson Fury Alexander Usman press conference with me. I've got Tyson Fury. How are you, sir? I'm good. Thank you very much. You happy? Happy, happy, happy. You weren't happy, happy the other day, though, were you? When? Monday. I was. I was always happy. Yeah? They won't get me down. Never. I'm happy character, happy person. Idiots like whatever his name is, I forgot his name already. Don't get me down, you know, bums like that will never get me down, you know. Houston, I've stepped up to the plate, credit to him. Good fight, good test for me, short notice, no sparring, no preparation. But do I give a fuck? I don't think so. Were there other opponents named, like, touted as possible opponents? Because this is, I'm surprised myself that you've gone in with someone like him. Ah, uh, he is what it is, isn't it? Yeah. Listen, I don't, I'm not interested in fighting a journeyman, I could have talked a journeyman on. But, you know, I'm not, I didn't fight for a journeyman, I didn't train for a journeyman, I trained for a good man, so that's what I want to do, I want to fight a good man and uh, prove again what I'm about, you know, I don't pick easy pickings, he's not an easy picking, he's as big as me, heavier than me, and he's got a better record than I have, and he's, he's got more knockouts than I've got fights, so there we have it. You said in the press conference that you seem that you don't believe that Derek Chisora has actually injured his hand. No, not interested in talking about Derek Chisora, he's a tosser, in my opinion. He ain't never going to get the opportunity to fight me again. Finished. Already beat him once, no need to repeat. Do you see this fight as a more difficult fight than what you was previously going to have with Derek against Susan? I think he's a better fighter than Derek Chisora and a harder fight, yes. Okay. Um, you talked in the press conference also about you haven't prepared for someone like Ustinov. As is going to come into play Saturday night, all your sparring being geared around someone yeah, like Derek. It isn't. I've got no preparation. It's like me coming off the street and having a fight with somebody. No preparation. I've done no nothing for this fella. Not one thing. Not practice for him. I've had no no sparring for him, and I've had no. I've not even looked at him. So it is what it is. You must be annoyed though and pissed off over the last. Kogan. I ain't annoyed, but you're trying to make me annoyed. So if you keep on, I'm going to body shot you. Right? I don't care. This is Lucas Brown. He threatened me earlier hey. as well. He's Indian heavyweight title holder. You know that? No, he's from Bangladesh. Easy. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> when he tickle your balls like that. <laughs> I'm not trying to annoy you. I was asking you a question. But anyway, now Lucas Brown's here. Yeah. I asked the question in the press conference. Is this a fight that interests you in the, in the future? Hey. Lucas is an annoying fat wanker. Would you call him fat? Yeah. I call him lanky. No, he's, he's Don't a, take he's it out of me. He's lanky than anything. Fat tosser. Fair enough. That's what he is. Anyway, going back to my as, question. As Tyson said, I'm, I'm the sort of person that would turn up for a fight and I would try and knock him out. So if it does it eventually happen and for some sort of world title or something like that, 100% it'll happen and it'll be a good fight. But right yeah, now... From the horse's mouth. Right now, without him having a title, this fight doesn't interest you, obviously. You should have press conference. This fight doesn't interest me at the minute. There's no way. I don't have a world title and neither does Lucas. Listen, I ain't here to tell lies. Boxing's about money. Listen, there's no glory in getting punched in the face for a living. It's about the dollars, pound coins. And when that fight makes financially good sense, that's the time that I will fight this fella. No problem, or he will fight me. He, the way things are going, Lucas will probably have a world title before I will. Hello. So he'll have to defend against me, not the opposite way around. Hopefully. You got yourself a fight next week in Wolverhampton on Friday against yep. Rodenko. Another big Russian. Yeah. We're called the Russian Twin Spankers. <laughs> 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 no. How do you think he's going to get up against Ustinov? I think he uses his reach to perfection. So no matter how or who he fights, I think the, the reach factor is always, always going to be there and that's, that's going to be what he relies on. So whether he fights me or Chisora or whoever he does fight. So he's a big boy, used enough, but I think he still re uses his reach better. Do you think it's a tougher fight for him than what he would have had with Derek? In ways, yeah. Yeah, 100%. Because of the height and reach of, of Ustinov, it would be a harder fight. Because he'd be able to sort of keep Chisora off a little bit more than what he would yeah, be able to Yeah, definitely. Ustinov. The guy's got no, almost the same length arms as me. So just let me just say, right, I've been sparring guys this big. Speed guys, maybe not even heavyweights. Been practicing all this, like blocking the shots. So if I do that, he's just going to go, you yeah, have one of them. Bang, bang. So it's going to get me. I've got no time in for this fight. That's why it's exciting. That's why it excites me. This is going to be a backyard rumble. And you better not blink because as soon as I detonate on him, he's going to stay down and he's not getting up. Or if he detonates on me, I'm, I probably do get up because I do get up. But I can guarantee he don't get up when I hit him. He'll stay here. All right, well, listen, Tyson Fury. Question for Coogan Cassius. 
<laughs> Go on. How's your balls? Oh. <laughs> Can you stop calling me a fat wanker? Call me a fat cunt the other day, a fat wanker today. Isn't that suggesting something? You need I'm to go to on a diet. Down. I've seen you fat before. I don't say anything to you, yeah, do I? I'm not fat now. You're trim like, now, <laughs> boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's only took three months. Absolutely. All right, well, listen, Lucas Brown, best of luck on your fight next Thank week. I'll be there. Tyson, hope you knock him out. Listen, it is what it is. If I knock him out, I do. If I don't, I'll probably get knocked out. They're trying to bump me off out of boxing anyway, so it'll be a good riddance, won't it? <laughs> It wouldn't be good readings. We, we need people like you in this division, so. We'll see, we'll see. See you Saturday night, tune in. It's definitely live on Box Nation. Oh, hey, oh! We forgot about this one, didn't we? <laughs> yeah, because I was so dang on little compared to these dudes. How happy are you that they asked you a press conference question because everyone kind of forgot about you in the yeah, press conference. Yeah, they did. Conference, they? I'm, I'm sitting there, I'm like, oh man, they want me now? It's a shame. This is like a steak sandwich, isn't it? <laughs> 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 Come back! Oh, oh, I guess I'm, oh. I guess I'm the meat, right? Yeah, you are I'm the, the meat. meat. He's the best bit of it. That's absolutely. Y'all love me. You love me. Both of them do. Coogan Cassius, Big Daddy, Lucas Brown, Eddie Chambers, Tyson Fury. Fast, fast Eddie. Come on. Yeah, don't get forget the that. Right. Fat Eddie. Fat oh, Eddie. Oh, 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 what are you saying? Oh. Coogan, Coogan, just, just do the, um, you know, do the nicknames of us all. Yeah, and I'll stand here. Yeah. What, what do I look like, my nickname? name? You all must know our nicknames. Yes. Right. Big Daddy Brown. Yes. Fast Eddie Chambers. Mm. Tyson Two Fast Fury. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh. He did that on purpose. Oh. <laughs> oh, what's my nickname? Yeah. What's my nickname, big boy? Your name is. I'm scared of you. That's what the hell your name is. I'm not fucking with you. You're too big. All right. Uh, thanks for talking to IFL TV. Tune into Box Nation on all your fights. Sorry about my phone here. I'm just making sure you know cut off. Sorry about that. Good. No problem. And if anyone else is filming this interview, you can't put it out because this belongs to IFL TV. I just want to point that out. But don't put it out. There'll be murders. See that? Fuck yeah. Acid Valley TV. Oh, all. before you go, Cougar. Yes. Before you go, big boy. Yeah. Eddie. What? My friend, American friend here, Eddie, is in the market for a hot UK bitch. Yeah? Whoa, so whoa, whoa, people whoa, whoa. get me arrested. What do you want? What do you want? <laughs> no, 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 no. What do you want? Do you this want guy. What do you want? Skinny? What do you no, want? No, no, no. We don't roll like that. Tell him, Eddie, what you want. What do you want? Light Be skin. serious. Light skin. Big yeah. What do you want? We'll get it for you. Well, don't you be shy. Uh, do you want an Australian one? He'll sort you out an Australian one. An Aussie one? As long as as long as this will not be on a line, I can say, but I'm not saying at all. Listen, it's because he's got a girl in the US. Yes. But oh, wait, oh, he don't want to uh, say No, no, no. Hey, wait, 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 wait. I'm in the market as well. I'm only married in Lancaster, so don't worry. When out of Manchester, gypsy rules apply. Only married in your local area. <laughs> Listen, I, want, I, I have, have nothing to do with this. Sexy baby. I have nothing to do with this. <laughs> and I'm not talking about Eddie Chambers neither. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you're really talking about me, goddammit. Uh, <laughs> see, see? I'm smart, man. I'm smart. Yeah, me now, too. I ain't trying to get now killed. Now, if there's any hardcore ladies out there who's looking hot and they want to, you know, Get it on with us, Frank. Awesome. Hit us up, baby. Well, Hit us up, baby. Oh, I, <laughs> I will say one thing. That, that poor girl getting smashed by Lucas, Tyson, and Eddie. My God. Imagine this. Three of us. I'm not going last. Eddie at the back watching out the camera. Go on. In the cupboard. Just those eyes picking up. Yeah, like this. Thank you very much. No problem. Well done. Thank you. Thank you very much.